going on everybody just doing some regular maintenance on my drums here uh, just changed the other two which you'll see I'm gonna fast forward time on those because I have two that I use up at the main kit which is all the way up there I don't know if you can see it and then this is the pre-show kit this is my studio maple snare right here and uh, yeah so enjoy the video and all I'm doing is basically just putting on fresh skins so uh, thanks for watching I'm gonna go get some cleaner for that right there, that smudge. So let's walk to the back and get some cleaner. let me give you a quick rundown I just put the head on this guy and I just uh, tuned the two heads up there uh, put new skins on those as well uh, this has the wood hoops on it so it's a little tougher to get the screws out uh, you got to pretty much twist all the way until the screw head pops up then you can get in there with your fingers and loosen it up it's a really really thick fat rim so I don't use any kind of a tension watch or a drum dial I base everything by feel so um, I still do a crisscross pattern which I'll start on this lug and then I'll go directly across from it and then I usually skip a lug 
and then crisscross from that going in a clockwise motion all the way around the drum um, depending on the lugs now that one up there my main snare I think is a 10 lug uh, the one next to it I think it's just a six uh, this one is an eight <clears throat> so basically yeah um, once I do that I I kind of get them snug with the key and then once everything is is firmly tightened uh, to the point to where it's not loose anymore I just kind of get it a little bit to where you can feel it start to get snug then I'll start my even uh, you know cranks going around basically so I'll do about a half turn to start going around every and then based on how high I want the drum I'll do like two half turns two half turns two half turns two half still doing that alternating rotation around the drum until I get it to the pitch that I want to get it to so this head I use the genera dry the popcorn snare while well, the 13 inch I use it as an auxiliary snare that one also has a genera dry on it and my main one has the HD dry so that one's kind of lets it ring out a little bit more um, and they're all Evans heads so but uh, yeah that was kind of a little cool video I hope you enjoyed it and if you have any questions comment below be sure to subscribe and uh, see you guys later thanks Hey, I know I'm gonna survive the hardship, but in your life, never sweet like a chocolate vanilla. Chain line, my